Well, it was a panel discussion on the homeless from a business perspective. Anna Marcos has more on the latest attempt to wrangle a solution to the problems on Skid Row. The homeless challenge has become too great for businesses to ignore. And now the Rotary Club of Los Angeles is holding its own forum to hash out possible solutions to the growing crisis on our streets. We've got a chronic problem of over 25,000 men, women and children, veterans living on the streets of Los Angeles, 45,000 here in the county of Los Angeles, thinking about the cold weather, El Nino coming. We've got to act quickly. This is a crisis. The crisis is a humanitarian one, but it also affects the bottom line of both businesses and the city. This is a problem that affects all of us. We all have to come together to ultimately develop and implement solutions. Homelessness also affects crime rates. For the first time in years, the crime rate has gone up, especially in the downtown area in Skid Row, home to much of LA's homeless population. In my opinion, the problem of homelessness is a problem of poverty, it's a problem of mental illness, and it's a problem of substance abuse. And those are the three things that need to be tackled. Many believe the best way to tackle the issue is permanent housing with supportive services for mental and drug problems. Places like Utah have become role models. The last 10, 11 years, we've had a 91% reduction in our chronic homeless numbers from 2,000 down to a little under 200. So we've had great success. Economically, it's a lot cheaper than incarceration, emergency rooms, that kind of health care. Los Angeles Police Department constantly out there um, enforcing. For many, it's a problem we can no longer ignore for the sake of our humanity, our well-being, and our pocketbooks. I'm Anna Marcos for L.A. This Week. Dozens of business and local leaders, some from as far away as Utah, attended the event.